Now you probably have the same problem as I do. How can I find a way to motivate my friends? Spouses is a different story. I'm blessed and I love you, Neri, so thank you for being active. Spouses and friends are just as hard. So in today's video, what I wanna do is give you three practical ways that you're going to be able to motivate your spouse or your friends to start working out and taking care of themselves. Before I go on guys, give the video a like. If you've been following the series, throw me an emoji, show, throw me the thumbs up emoji into the comments section so I know that you're following along every single day with these videos. Now this is a very tough situation because you're getting into fitness, you're feeling motivated, you're making changes, and you're seeing the progress. But the problem is you gotta put yourself into their shoes. You gotta start where they're starting. They probably don't enjoy working out. They enjoy and love the foods that they're eating and they don't wanna commit any extra time to sweating and working hard and being sore. Now we understand that that's all a part of the process, but they don't. So the number one thing that you need to do is push, but don't shove. I need you to focus on the 1% better every single day. Take one part of it. So instead of trying to get them to come in five days a week and doing doubles like you, then going for walks on the weekend, why don't you focus on what is the simplest thing that they can do? The simplest thing that they can probably do is maybe just go for a five minute walk with you, right? Let that five minute walk become a 10 minute walk. Let that 10 minute walk become a 20 minute walk. Let that 20 minute walk become their first day at Fit Club. Focus on the 1% better every single day. You can push, but don't shove. Now you've got them going and they're doing their first workouts at Fit Club, they're enjoying it, but the thing that we have to understand is that even before they start enjoying it, that working out isn't fun. Well, to most, I love working out and I know you love working out, but they probably don't enjoy working out. So you're gonna have to find a routine in a place that working out doesn't feel like working out. And you we all know where that place is, it's at Fit Club. Right? So we have to find physical activity. We have to find a home that they can call home and more importantly, that they enjoy it. Make sure that every workout, they're walking out sweating, smiling, and they've enjoyed themselves. Number three, the last, but maybe most important tip is that you don't wanna put on too many layers to getting them going and too many layers to being physically active. Workouts are the number one base. So the very first thing that they need to do is establish their workouts, okay? You've got them active, now let's get them into their workouts. Make sure that they're working out consistently. Give them at least six weeks of being consistent to the gym, going four to five times a week to Fit Club, but most importantly that they're attending. Now that we've got them attending, we can now start to tackle on some of the other issues like better sleep, better nutrition, or better lifestyle habits. But don't try and completely change them. You know what they say, old dogs can't learn new tricks? Well, this is the same. Be happy with the one new thing that we've layered into this person's life. Encourage them, give them positive affirmation. And remember what I said on the last point, you can push, but don't shove. And focus on the 1% better every single day. So I'm Coach RJ, guys. I hope you liked this video. If you liked the video, give it a like, and we'll see you on the next one.